knowing the playoff history of just Atlanta in general sports, do you feel any additional pressure to bring a championship to Atlanta at all? No. I mean, I, I'm, a, I'm a rookie head coach. I'm just trying to win, win one game at a time um, and get my team to trust me. You know, I think I built a good staff. We work really, really well together. I think the pieces that we've changed, I mean, geez, I gave Prince her first look and she hits a post-up shot and then a three. So, you know, um, you know, I think our roster is starting to look like how I wanted it to look. Um, you know, in the off season when I added Breland and I added Montgomery and the pieces we added were, were added for a reason and you're starting to really see why. I mean, Breland's been a consistent defensive stopper all season, but when she gets her offense going, oh my goodness. Like, every, it opens up for everybody else, you know, when you have that additional player on the perimeter that can shoot it, drive it, and pass it. Um, so, no, I don't, I'm not, you know, I just, I want to make the playoffs, and then I want to take one game at a time from there. But between now and then, it's still about us playing our best basketball heading into the playoffs because, you know, seeding matters in this league. But at the same time, when you get into one-game playoffs, you know, anything can happen. So you want to be playing good basketball at the end. You want your team healthy at the end to the best of your ability as much as you can control that. So, no, I'm not I'm definitely not putting any pressure on myself. I, I've lived in Atlanta for six months.